Good morning, everybody. It's Rick Uchi here with Ergen Web. We are at the range, and it's early. It's uh, fairly early this morning. A beautiful day before it gets too hot. It is windy, uh, as you guys can hear on the mic. I've actually got the mic under my shirt because it was way too windy on top of my shirt. Um, it's blowing hard today, probably 15, 20 mile an hour. I wish it wasn't the case, but that's what we got. So we're going to make the best of our conditions. What I've got here is the new Cloud Ultra in 25 caliber. We just got in the new barrels at Airgun Pro Shop, and that's why I'm out here today. I want to see what I can do. Uh, we're set up at 50 yards, and you know I was shooting yesterday. Of course, it was calm yesterday, and I was getting some really good accuracy. Now, I just topped this off, 250 bar. I've got the JSBs here. These are the 25s, 25.39s uh, uh, so or 25.4s. And we're going to just set some uh, rounds down range. Uh, in my testing yesterday, now this does have adjustable power. I found that for stability's sake, at least with these pellets, I had to back the power off. So I'll put some crony numbers and all that kind of stuff up so you guys have that data just to kind of know what you can get out of the gun on, bit, on different power settings. I'm going to be shooting the with the Frontier scope here. I've got phone scope set up. Because of the wind, uh, I've actually had cameras blow over. So the footage you're going to see of me on the target is going to be coming directly from the scope. And hopefully it turns out good. The sun's right in our face, so we've got a little reflection on the lens. But it's the best we can do right now. Hopefully this is going to show you guys what this rifle can do out here at the range at 50 yards. Let's get to it. Now, like all the other Evidex semi-autos, this does fire from the open bolt design. So it's cocked, loaded, ready to go. You have a safety right here. This gun is ready to fire. And let's go ahead and just take our first shot, just range it, see where we're, where we're at right now. Okay, I need to... There it is. A little bit low. Let's see where we at. We're just going to keep firing. The wind is coming right in our face. So I don't know if that's affecting our... Here it comes. <laughs> I don't know if that's affecting our pellet, you know, where it's dropping a little bit. But let's just keep going here. Okay, so that is an exceptionally good group in these conditions. Well, that's just a good group, period. Forget the conditions. I have one more shot. Let me take it here. Okay. Okay. Um, I got to tell you, that is pretty stinking awesome. Uh, we'll go grab that target or I'll take some pictures of the target so I can show you up close uh, to make sure that we're getting this footage the way we want. I'm going to stop the phone scope real quick. Okay, so I'm going to adjust for windage. I'm going to try anyway. Use my mill dots to get us in the red. Let's see. Let's see if I can do my job here. All right. All right, so there you go. There's another shot group.
Okay. All right, well guys, that's it. We got three shot groups off the same bottle, just so you know, as far as shot count goes. On this power setting, I probably get 50 or 60 shots easy. On high power, you get a few less, but for the most part, you get a lot of shots with this big bottle on here. Um, I think this is exceptionally good for these conditions. Well, just period, actually, in a semi-automatic. Um, being able to just rip shots off is pretty awesome. Guys, my name is Rick Utzler. Thanks for watching.